It's Thursday, June 1st, and this is your Milwaukee Rep Insider. Hello everyone, I'm Austin Bean here with all the latest on what's going on around the Rep. And we are so excited for McGuire's return to the Stackner Cabaret tonight for a two-week limited engagement run. We still have a few tickets left for this amazing production, so be sure to call into the ticket office right now at 414-224-9490 for the best availability. But first, get out your calendars and your red sharpie and circle Monday, June 19th. That day we will be hosting our Guys and Dolls one day sale, where you can save 25% off adult tickets. Now, this sale is only available for 24 hours, and this is a really good way to reserve the best seats for an amazing price. To purchase tickets at that 25% off, you'll want to make sure to use the promo code DICE. And don't fret, you can always get a reminder about the one day sale by following us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram at at MILWREP. You'll be seeing a lot more about this fantastic production soon, but first, we've got some great news about some of the actors you can expect to see on our stages this fall. Frank has some more information on that. Recently, we announced a few great names who will be joining us for the 2017-18 season, including rep favorite Jack Forbes Wilson, who will be seen in this fall's production of Souvenir in the Stackner Cabaret. Jack was last seen in the rep's record-breaking production of Liberace, and we're very excited to have him back. Also in the Stackner Cabaret this fall will be the hilarious musical murder mystery, Murder for Two, co-written and performed by Milwaukee High School of the Arts graduate, Joe Kenosian. This hilarious play will be directed by another rep favorite, J.C. Clements, who also directed The Devil's Music and I Love a Piano. Finishing out the season will be the great American classic, Our Town, and this truly beautiful play will feature an amazing cast, including rep associate artists, James Pickering and Laura Gordon, who will be playing the iconic role of the stage manager. Also in the production are Milwaukee favorites Chike Johnson, Elizabeth Leto, and Matt Zambrano, who you last saw as Charlie in this past season's production of The Foreigner. Of course, more casting is still underway for all our shows, but keep checking back for complete casting news soon. Until then, you can find more information about our next season on our website at www.milwaukeerep.com. Calling all young performers. Milwaukee Repertory Theater is searching for a Tiny Tim to deliver the most memorable and spirited line in A Christmas Carol. God bless us, everyone. On Saturday, June 17th, we will be hosting auditions for young performers of all ethnicities, ages 7 to 17, for several roles in Milwaukee's favorite holiday tradition, including the famous role of Tiny Tim. To audition, parents should email acckidssm at milwaukeerep.com with the young performer's name, a recent photo, age, height, and weight, a parent guardian's phone number and email address, and a brief note from the young performer telling us about themselves and why they would like to be in A Christmas Carol. Those chosen from submissions will be notified of an audition time and receive materials to prepare for the audition, with callbacks held later in the day. And remember, all young performers must be accompanied at the audition by a parent or legal guardian. We look forward to seeing you all on June 17th. Thanks, Lita. That's it for this week. But before we go, we want to take a moment to celebrate all of the great work of our entire company during the 2016-17 season. There have been so many great shows this past year, from Man La Mancha to The Foreigner to McGuire, and so, so much more. There's also been a lot of great work that's gone on off of our stages as well, including all of the great community engagement events from the past year. Thank you to everyone who put their heart and soul into creating the wonderful art on and off of our stages this year. But mostly thank you for joining us this season in our theaters and beyond and coming along the journey with us. To close out this episode, we wanted to give you a little reminder of some of the great things you saw over the 2016-17 season. Cheers. I am I, Don Quixote.